want? Justice! When do we want it? here for today for a call of actions to work with our brothers and sisters up here and sitting down. Creator is with us. He's given that to us. My sister Nicole Smith was murdered in my home on the Manchester Reservation in 2017 and I'm here to say her name and to raise awareness about her murder and it being unsolved. Nicole Smith! Nicole Smith! Nicole Smith! Nicole Smith! So it's definitely affected our family in ways that are pretty much um, unspeakable of um, my parents got pretty ill after my sister passed away, just being heartbroken, um, always living in fear because the murder was unsolved. You know, obviously seeing her children grow up without their mother has been super traumatic for everybody. They've suffered from depression, um, mental illness, other things that follow with that, with the loss of their mother. To live com. all my relations. Thing that no family wants to have to do, which is to put out a missing flyer for their brother, their son. The missing and murdered Indigenous peoples issue and violence against women has been affecting people in my family for multiple generations. Uh, my aunt was shot on the, on the Hoopa Reservation in the early 80s. She was 18 years old and she died. And to this day, my family does not have a clear story on what happened to her. When you lose someone and you don't have closure, I think it's like trying to find your way through the darkness. There's this uncertainty that looms over your life. I last seen him January the 5th of uh, 2020. My grandson, Nick Patterson, the, our, missing, our missing family member, lived with me there at Lookout. And it, I was probably the last family member to see him alive. Um, like I said, he was 26 years old. It's been four years ago that uh, this, this happened and there's been absolutely no resolution of uh, this case whatsoever. Um, Florence is here. Come up please. Oh, I see you're sitting down. You're just left up in the air. You don't know. And, and it, it's hard to accept. 